Erin, we've just seen the Bank of Canada go 50 bips when the market was expecting 75. How do you think the US equity market reacts when we get to that point for the Fed, where it stops going 75 and starts going 50? I, th I do think that that you know, pivot, if that's what you want to call it, will be you know, a positive catalyst for markets. But you know, the, the Fed is going to be moving down to 50 basis points at a point when they start to see you know, more significant economic weakness on the horizon. And so you know, it's, a, it's a little bit of a careful balance, because while the Fed is slowing, they're certainly not pausing, and they're nowhere close to cutting rates. And so I still think that the equities will trade down. You may get a little bit of a relief rally on the news, but I don't think it's going to be an all clear signal for equities. So Aaron, on that, if we get a relief rally, what do you do with it? I would fade the relief rally right now. You know, over the last uh, week or so, we've been resetting shorts or underweights um, at you know sort of higher levels, taking that as an opportunity to get more underweight stocks. I don't think yet that we've received that all clear signal. So I think you you know respect the r the rally, but look to reset uh, shorts at higher levels.